tiny dragon video. I'm not pretty today, but that is. Look at that. Woo! I was off work today and been on this baby all day. My truck's in the shop, but that's another video, another time. All right, time to catch up with the Young Brothers. It's been a little bit since we've done an update. Like, Josh is even a year older. I am. Okay, it's not been that long since we've been had an update, but Josh really did have a birthday. All right, Josh, tell me how this door works, because I'm looking at it going, where's the screen? has a screen built in the top. That's gonna be perfect for some Tennessee living. And you don't have to worry about losing your screen ever. That's right, and you're not gonna accidentally push through it or something there no. at the bottom. Somebody comes through, you could just open up a little bit at the top. That's really nice. It's a handle. We just don't have a handle on it yet. And it doesn't make the noise. All right. Wow, this looks great. What do you call this, cove, cove base? Cove base, yeah. Cove base. Now, the reason we decided to go with this, it's a vinyl product instead yeah. of like a wood, um, is because we're gonna rent this place and this is just a lot easier maintenance, easier to clean if anybody's moving in and out, so. Look at that. It's on the bottom of the cabinets. It's really nice. Very clean. All right, so one thing that I did not think about or notice first off is we have this sink here, but we're not going to do a dishwasher or a garbage disposal. And again, that's because this is going to be a rental property and we're trying to minimize maintenance issues. Although, if we ever decide that we need that, we can pull one of these cabinets and put it there. Um, this sink though is a little small, not very deep, and I didn't realize it until we installed a normal size fixture on it. And I realized, okay, we've got to do something a little different with sinks. So we've got one on order. It's actually going to be longer, and it's gonna be one bowl instead of two, and deep. So that should suffice. We're gonna to have to cut the counters, recut them. Um, the lazy Susan down here, the sink will hang down a little further, we'll punch through, but we still should be able to use this lazy Susan. So that project will be in the works. Getting ready for appliances, got our hot water heater. You can see that um, the Trex deck around the moat drain and the grate there worked out really nicely. That door. So far, the only, you know, trouble we ran into was the sink. Should have caught that uh, when I was looking, but I did not. And the second issue we ran into, so the first toilet delivered and, can't show it to you, but it was cracked on the base is get a one piece toilet. We'll have to order this. Keep it at a 12 inch rough end and make it one piece. And then we're gonna build the wall out just behind the toilet, um, like a three sided box that'll bracket mount to the real wall. So if we ever have to get to the tub or pull the tub, you'd move your toilet and just move the three sided box. And on the top of this three sided box, I guess we'll uh, build it about this high. We'll build maybe an eight inch shelf and put a little piece of marble across it. So we can frame out a little wall behind a toilet, bring the bowl in because we'll do a round bowl and then um, have a shelf here. So it's gonna look really, really nice. We've already figured out where we wanna keep our cable. So I've marked that, um, get the electrician out here to clean up that box. But this place is almost ready like we are almost there and uh, we'll have it rented out and so thanks to the young brothers this looks fabulous you guys want to say anything about the update i kind of went through and it's great. i think it looks great i mean ready to be done because <laughs> yeah, you got another one to start yeah, on yeah, yeah.
So, uh, I'm, j I'm just super impressed, yeah, it's really. good. The base makes it look so much better. I know. It's a finish now. Finished, yep. yeah. So, you guys are just amazing. And um, if anybody's looking for things done right, it's Young Brothers Construction. Yeah. Things done right. 